Hi, and thanks for joining us in the Departure Lounge. This video series will take you on a journey full of inspiration and practical advice for the best goodbye. Hi, Diana here. Today we're going to be talking location, location, location. Redbird is uh, the home of personalized celebrations of life that can happen anywhere. So we know the importance of hosting a celebration of life. Um, there are three tips that we can give you when thinking about, um, you know, the venue for a celebration of life. The first really um, is thinking about what is the inspiration for the celebration of life? What should it reflect the personality of the, your loved one? Um, this will really help narrow your focus when trying to figure out where your um, celebration should be. You know, was the person a golfer? Do you want it on a golf course? Did they love uh, Wednesday trivia night at the pub? Or did they just love lounging in the backyard, really? This, these are some of the considerations that can really narrow down your choices. Also, the second tip we can give you is the size of the venue. So when thinking about the celebration of life, a good place to start when thinking about a size is your guest list. So, you know, you have your family, your extended family, and your friends, but then there's also the, you know, your loved one's colleagues, their peers, um, and maybe their classmates. This should also help narrow down um, when thinking about a venue for yourself. Um, the size can be a really important thing. It shouldn't be too big, it shouldn't be too small, it should just be right, just right. You know, picking up on the Goldilocks theme. And you know, our creative memorial planners are always here to help you guide you with your options. The third one, which is probably the key to what everybody's asking, is your budget. When comparing location costs, you know, it can be a real driving factor. It's a good idea to get quotes from all places. Um, it'll give you a complete picture of what they offer. Some will have a lower rental fee, but they'll have additional costs for furniture rentals or AV or staffing. So you really want to get that quote and pull them all together and that should give you a complete picture of what options you really have. And it'll give you a good standing on for your celebration of life. There are so many details that go into a celebration of life and the venue is probably the biggest decision and investment that you will encounter. Choose wisely and remember that you don't have to do it alone. Redbird um, is here to help guide you through those options. We have um, you know, various connections within the City of Toronto and uh, know our locations very well. And there may be some that you don't even know that are out there and available to you. So once again, what are the three tips? The inspiration, the size, and the budget. I hope this was helpful and I look forward to joining you again in the Departure Lounge. Take care.